Hello children. What's going on? Having fun? Busy? With what? With studies? Or playing? Playing, no? All right. Play. These are the days. Your age is like that. That you need to play. Physical activity is very good to make you strong and fit. But take out some time for studies also. So you have seen all the videos of the previous chapters and the last chapter who are they this lesson you had seen no? after that another lesson was there lesson 8 but lesson 8 I'm not going to take up why because that lesson I have deleted in every class some lessons have been deleted so I have deleted for you that lesson and few more lessons will be deleted and I will let you know which ones followed. So now I am taking up the next lesson. Very interesting lesson. You have celebrated some festivals no? recently Raksha Bandhan, Ganesh Chaturthi, then Janmashtami, then your mothers also celebrated Tij and all. When festivals come, then what all things you do? You wear nice new clothes. Your mummy makes lovely dishes, tasty ones. Na? And sweets you eat. You meet your friends. You wish them. But now, it's a bit difficult for all of you to go to your friend's house, speak to them, enjoy with them. So now you are enjoying at home with your parents or brothers and sisters. Followed. And in this lesson, we are going to see some festivals festivals are not only for fun sake we don't celebrate it only to enjoy to have uh, good food and wear new dress and all it is a time when we come together Come together with our relatives, with our friends and this way we share our joys with one another. That is also one reason why we celebrate festivals. We get together, all of us meet and that is the time when we enjoy with them, with our friends, with our relatives. Festivals are two types you can say. One is religious festivals which we celebrate in our own religion. You see we are having many religions. All of you all must be knowing that many people in this country they are following different religions like Hindus, Muslims, no? Christians, Sikh. Buddhists, Jains, Parsis, all these are different religions. And every religion has a festival. Followed? So we celebrate this as what? Religious festival. Many of us are belonging to 
different religions so we celebrate those who are hindus they celebrate diwali holi all these festivals no raksha bandhan janmashtami ganesh chaturthi dashera those who are muslims they celebrate which festivals eid no and christians they celebrate christmas easter good friday the sikh they celebrate guru purab and many other festivals like lohri and baisakhi so these festivals come once a year like how we celebrate our birthdays why we celebrate our birthdays because and when we celebrate it on that day when we were born every year that day we celebrate the the birthdays same way festivals are something happened something special happened on that particular day and then every year we celebrate it as that festival all right so same way we are having some national festivals also like independence day republic day and gandhi jayanti so you don't have to go deep into why we celebrate these festivals national festivals but we must know that the whole country celebrates the national festivals everyone whether he is a hindu muslim sikh or christian whoever it is everyone rejoices enjoys that day and celebrates remembers the day when we got independence when we became a republic and we remember gandhi ji on his birthday 2nd october so the reason why we celebrate festival i hope you have understood and now i am going to take you to the screen you will see many things and you will be able to understand all the things all the festivals which we are going to see so are you ready to go to the screen but before that once again i want to tell you be good to everyone keep smiling always and keep rocking always do good to others and take care of yourselves and take care of your parents always obey your parents they are next to god as god is to us but god cannot come and look after everyone come down and give you the food and this and that but parents are providing everything to you follow so give them respect love them obey them so now let's go to the screen and see the lesson enjoy it and have fun always understood so be good so children see the screen now all of you welcome to lesson 9 fairs and festivals key points in this lesson all of you festival lesson we will see diwali then eid christmas guru purab independence day republic day gandhi jayanti follow up festivals are special days people wear new clothes everyone has lots of fun on these days festivals are very special days something or the other happened on that particular day and that is why we celebrate festivals any one's festival it is we wear new clothes when it is our festival we will distribute sweets we give gifts to others and have lots of fun that is why we like festivals all of you all have just celebrated few festivals 
and you all had fun maybe this year you did not have so much fun why because uh, so many problems are there you had to stay in the house and everything so that's why you did not enjoy so much maybe but then also at home with your parents with your brothers and sisters i'm sure you enjoyed so we are going to see a few festivals in this lesson festivals of india now the first festival we are going to see is diwali all of you all celebrate diwali diwali is a festival of lights why it is called festival of lights you see because everywhere you will find lights are there followed lights everywhere you will find lights that's why we call it festival of lights people light candles and diyas they give sweets and gifts to their friends and relatives candles these are candles and these are diyas people light them all right and then they give gifts also to their friends they give sweets to their friends you see gifts giving one another they exchange their gifts then they give sweets then they burst crackers they light diyas so this is how diwali is celebrated with great joy follow it on eid people go to mosque to pray you see we all go to our places of worship to pray the hindus go to the temple the christians go to the church the sikh they go to the gurudwara and you will find that the muslims go to a mosque see this is a mosque this is a mosque so they go there to pray on which day on the day of their festival that is eid they also eat lots of sweets and wear new clothes followed why because they are also happy very happy on that day they wish each other this way they hold each other and wish one another eid mubarak this is how they say eid mubarak eid mubarak you see these are two families over here you see how they pray the boys the girls the ladies the men all of them pray on this day especially for their families and others also now comes christmas christmas is celebrated on 25th december every year on this day christmas tree is decorated see this is the christmas tree why it is celebrated on 25th december because lord jesus was born on 25th december so they celebrate the birth or you can say the birthday of lord jesus christ you see jesus was born all right children are happy because santa claus gives them gifts on that day see this is santa claus children are told that if you are good children then definitely santa claus will come and give you gifts so i will play one song also santa claus song for you and you listen to the song very carefully just now
So children, did you all hear the song? Liked it? I'm sure you all like the song. And we sing this song on Christmas Day for Santa Claus. Santa Claus, he brings gifts for children. All the grown-ups tell the children this story about Santa Claus. And you see, everyone on Christmas Day, they wish one another Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. See, the Christmas tree here and here the Jesus, baby Jesus over here, born. Here again, see, different houses, they decorate their Christmas tree in a different way with lights and balloons and small small toys also gifts also they keep under the Christmas tree. Next festival is Guru Purab. Every year Guru Purab is celebrated on Guru Nanak Dev Ji's birthday. When it is celebrated Guru Purab? On Guru Nanak Dev Ji's birthday. This is Guru Nanak. He was born on that day and that's why people celebrate Guru Purab. On Guru Purab, people pray in Gurdwaras. This is a Gurdwara. This is also a Gurdwara. Followed? Fairs are held and free food is given to all. All those who go to the Gurdwara, free food is given to them and fairs, you know what is a fair? When you see the picture, you will come to know what is a fair. I am sure you all have been to a fair. It's a mela and many of the places you will find such type of Bhangra dance and different types of dances people do on the festival Guru Purab. See, this is the free food being given to people. This is known as langar. Followed? What is this? Langar. Free food given to people. All the people come and food is served to them. And you see, this is fun fair. Fairs are held, no? All the swings and all shops and so many other places to play for children, for grown-ups to enjoy. Such type of things are held on Guru Purab. Understood? We also celebrate national festivals. These special days are celebrated by the whole country. Now, up to now, whatever you have seen, uh, the festivals, they, they were religious festivals celebrated by the people who, who follow some religions, no? Like the Hindus, the Muslims, the Christians, the Sikh. They follow these religions and they celebrate. Though they invite others to their house, others go to their uh, house to wish them. But the whole country, wherever it is celebrated, all these festivals are celebrated, it is celebrated by that particular religion. But national festivals are celebrated by the whole country. Whether he is a Hindu, Muslim, Christian, Sikh or anyone, they all celebrate the national festivals. So the very first festival is the Independence Day. You see, on this day we got our independence from the British rule. And 15th August we got a independence and every year we celebrate Independence Day on 15th August. Just now 15th August passed off few days ago but this year we did not have it in a grand way because of the corona which is going on these days but usually when it the things were normal then the festival is celebrated with great joy all over India. Main independent who I am independent. Nobody is going to keep us as a slave. We are free. We are free to do anything, stay anywhere, work anywhere. But 
we have to do the things in a proper way not to hurt or any type of um, bad things we should not do we are not free to do any bad things understood all of you next you see is republic day we celebrate republic day on 26 january every year this is also a national festival you see the grand parade is going on over here this is the red fort followed here you see the children all of them saluting our national flag again you can see the parade in both the places so we wish one another happy republic day Gandhi Jayanti is celebrated on 2nd October every year. Every year on 2nd October, we celebrate Gandhi Jayanti. Why? Because Gandhi Ji, we call him Bapu also. Followed? He was born on 2nd October and his birthday we celebrate as Gandhi Jayanti. So the freedom that we are enjoying today it's all because of Mahatma Gandhi what was his name Mohan Das Karamchand Gandhi followed but we call him Mahatma Gandhi or Bapuji because of love for him you can see Gandhi ji over here Gandhi Jayanti being celebrated you see children are celebrating this is the charkha Gandhi ji used to make his own cloth, his clothing with this charkha handmade clothes. He used to wear the dhoti and he used to make it with this charkha. Follow? And then you see the children have kept a picture of Gandhi ji, have garlanded Gandhi ji's picture. And we also do the same thing on Gandhi Jayanti day. And all these children are dressed up as Mahatma Gandhi. Why? Because they are having some fancy dress show or something. That's why. So children see festivals of India. Festivals when we celebrate, it's not only to eat good food, uh, sweets and wear new clothes and have fun. Festivals are meant for us to spread love everywhere, love one another and bring people closer. We should become closer to one another. For that reason, we are celebrating festivals also. Not only to eat good food and to wear new clothes and have fun. So, our duty is to bring people closer through the festivals by inviting them having fun with them and enjoying with them nicely so the lesson ends now a small lesson but very good lesson and you must be wondering why madam did not take up lesson 8 lesson 8 i have deleted for you because some chapters have to be deleted due to the coronavirus in every class the lessons have been deleted so for you also i have deleted lesson eight and that's why we skipped that lesson and came to lesson nine followed the lesson is over and i want you all to be cheerful and happy always be good to others listen to your parents always and always help others help your mommy help your daddy at home help your neighbors if they need you so you will be a good person you have to be become a good person for becoming a good person you need to be obedient and do your work sincerely 
Many of y'all are sending me so many assignments, very good children y'all are, but few have not started doing anything. So when you are going to do, when the whole thing is piled up, then you will do, it's going to be very difficult for you. And I want to make a request over here at this place that uh, whenever you are watching the video, you are not subscribing. Please subscribe the subscription button, you see, and press the bell. And this is how whenever I upload a new video, you will get the notification. No need for me to send the link. Automatically, you will come to know that a new video has been uploaded. So please subscribe this channel of mine and put your likes and comments also in the channel, whatever you feel like. All right, some good comments which you feel uh, is good, you should, must make the comment. Follow up and then do all the exercises in your book, complete all the lessons and whatever things I'm giving you now, it's because I'm going to give you a test, observation test, third observation test. For that reason, I am giving you the revision work to do at home. So please do it and have an amazing day. Enjoy. Have fun. Be very good to others. Follow? So, thank you very much. Bye till I meet in the next lesson.